Hi guys. It's straight hair. Um, so today I thought I would tell you guys about the honors degree. Um, but first I have something that I have to do. I'm going for a photo shoot um, for uh, these guys that I met a few months ago, a year ago. And they sell bags. So I'm going to do a photo shoot for them. And then after that, we'll get into the vlog. <laughs> yeah. By the way, I have no idea what to do with my hair. Absolutely. I don't know if I should... Like... This hanging down here doesn't look very nice. I don't know if I should just take all of it up. And leave the top. Mm. Yeah, I think so. Hello again. Oh, I should look there. So I finished doing my hair and my makeup sooner than I had expected. So let me start the story of why i am doing my honesty um when people who are not south african a lot of my friends when they ask me what it is that i'm studying i say i'm doing my honors degree and they're like what is that and then i have to explain it somewhere between your bachelor's and your master's and they're like oh okay so i don't know why the honors degree is still like a big thing in south africa is it like a big thing still in other countries? I don't know. Um, but my question really is, I don't understand why tax, so UP engineering specifically, I can't speak for other universities or like other um, degrees in tax because I don't know how it works. I don't understand why tax makes you do four years, four torturing years, of engineering and then you get the degree without the honors um title behind it like i i i don't know um so some people say yeah you do the honors after and then you're already halfway through your masters and i'm like but what if you don't want to do your masters um yeah i don't know personally i think it's a I don't know. Um, maybe one of you guys there who knows the whole system can explain to me like what's up. Um, yeah. But anyway, why did I decide to do my honors? Well, after four years at Tux doing engineering, I was like very traumatized. I did not want to open another book. I did not want to read another find x or solve this or you know design that um yeah i was up to here with uh books and studying um but i guess i will tell you after my photo shoot why i did it anyway I just came back and I am tired and I just want to sleep and I have a headache but I still have uh, quite a few things to do uh, but anyway to pick up pick up where I left off um I think I said I was gonna say why I did not honest yeah so the year was 2017 and it was December 
and I didn't know what I was going to do in the 2018. I was done with school. Um, I didn't particularly like my job. I really wanted to go abroad and uh, do an internship abroad. And I used to, I, where I was doing an internship, it was it's a multinational corporation. So I thought, man, it would be so nice if I could do an internship with them, but in a different country. And I tried, it didn't work out. So I uh, applied for the graduate program here in South Africa. And I also applied to do my honors, right? So I got accepted for my honors and then I was like, uh, do I really want to stay here again and work for this company for like two more years or do I want to go elsewhere, you know, and somewhere else where I feel like I could learn more. But anyway, I went for the, I think I did like four interviews, um, for the grad program, like in different departments with different managers. And uh, the manager that wanted me, he was in the like uh, purchasing department, so procurement. But the way that it's titled, it made it sound like it's a finance department. And so I thought it was a finance position, like I was going to be a finance grad. And I was like, man, I don't want to do finance. There's a reason why I did engineering. I do not like finance. So I declined it. Um, and he called me in he's like oh why did you decline and i told him you know what i don't think i'm a good fit for your department and he's like no you'll be like uh doing quality related work and i was like okay let me give it a try you know let me just i don't have any other perspectives is that the word anyway i don't have any other options um, the money's good, why not? So I was there. Uh, the oh, not I was there. The program is two years or was two years, and because I had been there for a year already, I thought, man, I'm gonna be bored because it's just gonna be going to work, work nine to five, come back home, and so I decided to do my honors and do the grad program at the same time. The first year of the grad program, I couldn't attend any classes. Um, so tax honors, uh, tax honors, or tax in general doesn't have night classes. I don't, I've never heard of anyone going to tax saying they're going to a night class it's because um, at work they didn't give me like a study leave. So I couldn't attend any lectures. Um, I was doing like projects with other fellow graduates um we had like a big project to do so i didn't have time to really do the honors the first year so i think i only registered for one module in the whole entire year um but fast forward it's uh, almost three years now that i've been doing this honors module and i'm supposed to finish this november um is it worth it honors degree I don't think so like unless you are super passionate about engineering uh, or super passionate about academia like you want to stay in the academics um, world then yes of course it is but in terms of getting a job in my experience I don't think so because my previous employer wasn't really interested in whether I had like did post grad studies, I don't know. Maybe it's different for other companies. I don't know, but I would say do your honors if you're very passionate about what you studied. Like that's what you want to do. You want to stay in that area for like a really long time. For me, the use that I that it gave me is that it allowed me the opportunity to do an internship in the USA. So last year, um, around October-ish, I got accepted to do an internship with the same company in the US. And the only way I could do that, or they were only accepting people who were studying or registered with the university. 
honestly that's the only plus or positive to doing this honors degree <laughs> thus far <laughs> thus far um but i don't know maybe i'm being negative um should you do your honors degree like i said it's up to you like really think about it what do you want to do I'm, I'm saying in engineering let me not speak for other degrees or other universities when it comes just speaking about tax engineering i would say do it only if you're passionate about engineering um but that being said it might open other doors for you like it did for myself and in another video i will share with you guys what my experience was um having the opportunity to do an internship abroad um yeah please let me know if you are watching this video please let me know what your experience is um with your post-grad studies how is it going do you feel like it's beneficial for you um is it hectic is it easy what do you plan to do after your post-grad studies like what do you plan to do with that knowledge yeah that's that's the whole story of my honest degree and i hope i will no not i hope i know i'm going to finish it i have to otherwise man what a waste of time and money but yeah thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe bye